following contest is kept for one round with a seven minute time limit in the brown belt division at 170 pounds. Introducing your first competitor fighting out of the blue corner. Representing Team Took, this is Steve Portillo. Let's go, Steve! And introducing his opponent across the stage, fighting out of the red corner. Representing Jared Klotz, BJJ, this is Michael Duran. Gotcha. Steve Portillo, Michael Duran, Steve pulling double duty tonight, both refing and competing here. And of course, representing that team took. There's a big, I mean, a lot of people came out from team took, you know? Yeah, definitely. Also, um, Henzo Gracie, strike and submit. Travis Moore, BJJ. John's Gym. There, yeah, there's yeah, a lot of gyms out here that have really put a lot of competitors on this card. Uh, Drain here looking like he's looking for a far side, looking like for that Kimura. He's trying to push that left hand underneath the tricep there, pull it all the way through. So he's got his right hand kind of in position by, by having it there blocking that hip. He's in a good, good place to, to, to work here. Yeah, working his way back up top. Portia recognizes the grip, immediately takes it away. On, Control here from Mr. Duran. You know, if I was interested in upcoming shows and interview fighters from Fury FC and uh, Submission Hunter, where can I find that information from? Uh, you know, guys, you can go to GarciaPromotions.com, see all the information coming up for our events. As well, you can go to Submission Hunters Pro's YouTube page. And also on there, there's an awesome show, Stuff Happens, with yours truly, Richard Burmaster, talking about stuff that's happening with Garcia Promotions, Fury Fighting Championship, Submission Hunter Pro. Uh, guys, go make sure you go to the website, GarciaPromotions.com. Tons of articles, recaps of the event. Awesome website. Past the five-minute mark. Michael Mitchell Duran here, representing Jared Klontz, BJJ. Jared Klontz, longtime competitor, BJJ black belt here in Texas. Lots of black belts in this side and west side of Texas have gotten their start there with Jared Klontz, who I believe is an Alvis Solis black belt. Been around quite a long time, excellent professor, and great work here for Mitchell Duran. Using that left hand to control top wrist there of Portillo. <laughs> Portillo doing a great job with the defense here. His hands high and tight. It's really hard to grip fight here with such, with such a longer opponent. I'd like to see Portillo get his head a little bit higher so he's not so far down on the body. Tio doing a good job keeping his chin down, trying to work his head across. Great defense.
Really impressed with the back control here from Mitchell Duran. Just as I say that, transitions to mount. Great awareness that Steve was, Steve was adjusting here to work his way out. Working up to high mount here. Dangerous water. And he's definitely going to start working for an attack here. Like he wants to push into the elbow. What should Portillo do here? You know, he's, he's doing the right thing. He's, he's causing motion. Uh, <laughs> just a, a great adjustment there for Mitchell Duran. Uh, almost had his back again for a second, but what he was doing exactly what he needed to do. He can't keep his hips flat. He can't stay flat on his back. He's got to keep moving. Here's going to be an arm bar attempt. And with these long legs here, Duran, this is going to be hard for Portillo to defend. And there you go. Ladies and gentlemen, your winner of this match with an armbar, Michael Duran.